Hi, I'm Andy Burrows here for BWB TV, and I'm here with Jeff Kim. He's the Managing Principal, Life Science Consulting at EPAM Systems. Thank you for joining today. Thank um, you for having me. So first up, could you just tell me a little bit more about EPAM and why are you attending Bypress International? Uh, absolutely. EPAM um, was founded back in 1993. Uh, we're really an engineering company by heart. Um, Traditionally, we have a lot of uh, technical folks that, that are architecting solutions. Um, you know, we provide a, an overall solution uh, in most recent years around adding consulting strategy, um, adding uh, design thinking, as well as our core competency around engineering and development. Um, mm -hmm. We're here at uh, Bioprocess International to really just uh, meet with our clients, uh, you know, sync up with their industry leaders, uh, share a perspective on life sciences and healthcare. How does EPAM help uh, healthcare and life sciences or companies reach their business goals? Yeah, absolutely. That's a great question. Um, so EPAM works with healthcare and life sciences companies, and, and really we uh, work specifically around their mission critical systems and applications. Um, EPAM obviously is a, a global engineering organization. Um, we help our clients better understand their business strategies. So we add uh, consulting strategy with uh, design thinking to basically enable uh, more optimized solutions uh, in their mission critical applications. Right, and life science, healthcare industry, there's a lot of disruption um, recently. There's yeah. gonna, that's only gonna continue. Right. Um, what are some examples of uh, technology's impact on the industry today, do you think? Yeah, um, that's another great question as well. Um, so from a technology standpoint, how it affects healthcare and life sciences organizations, um, you know, these days it's all about collecting and understanding their data, right? So they, they have a lot of disparate data, uh, databases, data warehouses. Um, so it's really bringing that together for the clients um, right. and, and providing insights. So leveraging technologies such as um, AI, artificial intelligence or RPA for robotics processing, uh, enables their clients to look at the disparate data, bringing it all together and, and providing real-time insights on that data to help them further progress their drug development life cycles, right. getting, getting medicines and therapies out to you know, the patients quicker. Okay, great. Yeah. And um, so I've seen one of your ads, there's the headline that says uh, EPAM engineering the future. Yes. Um, can you give an example of how EPAM is doing that? One of the great projects that we have that, that really headlines the uh, you know, engineering technology of the future uh, is called Lab of the Future, right? So we're really trying to relook at how labs are built within a lot of the pharmaceutical organizations that we uh, work with and basically enable the scientists to be able to quickly enter lab data, to be able to get that data out to the right folks within the data management teams, uh, biostatisticians, uh, management, to enable that further progress of getting you know, quicker information, better insights, right? So we leverage technologies like artificial intelligence, uh, RPA, robotics processing, to enable some of those things. Um, we have uh, you know, things like virtual reality goggles that enable scientists to use in the labs to input data, to look at wow. um, computer screens that, yeah, yeah. that essentially you look through the VR goggle versus on, on a computer itself. Yeah. Very cool. <laughs> yeah. And um, so could you, I was hoping you'd give me a brief overview of um, the services that EPAM offers um, specifically in support of digital business in life sciences and healthcare? Um, so EPAM offers, uh, to support the digital business, uh, EPAM offers uh, strategic consulting, design thinking, uh, coupled with our core competencies around engineering and development, application development, so mission critical systems. We also offer to operate those applications and systems, and, and then we work with the clients to further optimize the applications. Right. Uh, really getting an understanding of clients' business requirements, their MVPs, or what, what's most important to them, um, and essentially providing that overall end-to-end -end solution. Um, I think at, at the end of the day, that's what clients are looking for, it is not just you know new technologies and applications being put in for the sake of being put in, but really what's gonna help them with their overall business process, right? And, and that makes sense. Um, you can also go to uh, EPAM's website, 
mm-hmm. uh, www.epam.com to get a better understanding of our offerings and, and capabilities as well. Great. Right. Thank you very much for your time, sir. Yeah, very, very welcome. Thank you.